I'm a black man in Beverly Hills. I, 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 I am the American dream. This is it. Our new home. New beginnings. We got money! What are you worried about? I'm worried about how you got it. Let's enjoy this. Welcome, neighbors! Right. We are the, the Smiths. Smiths. My name is Carl Black. It's a little ironic that that uh, your name is Black. Don't you are say black. it, bitch. What? That's the first oh, warning. Yes. Happy purge, neighbors. Happy purge! <laughs> Tonight is the purge. You ain't done nothing wrong, you got nothing to worry about. Purge ain't about you. It's about the rest of you, and you know who you are. Purge these nuts. Oh my god, Dad. Tonight's only the most dangerous night all year. People can get away with whatever crime they want for 12 hours. Mr. Black, you're not wanted here. I'm going to cut the power now. Maybe if you smile, it would help us find you in the dark. Ah! We on lockdown, they can't do nothing to us. You have to pay your debt tonight. I've never seen a pit bull with a perm. I ain't scared. Whoever let you walk out the house with that jacket is not your friend. Think that you can move into my neighborhood? Waving your hands in the air like you just don't care? It feels like we're in a horror movie. Time to die, everyone. Movie over. We gotta do what white people don't do. Survive? We're all going to die. You gonna die if you keep talking. I'm just talking about Shut up. Who got a belt? Okay. Gotta make sure there ain't no more black people around here because they will snitch. <laughs> <laughs> up on the rooftop, click, click, click. I'm about to shoot off called blacks. Think you gonna run me out of this nice house? I'm from the hood. <laughs> Your car block from Chicago, right? Yeah, and you're Caesar from the planet of the age. Don't put that Ebola finger in my face. What a fun movie. I mean, I, I'm so used to seeing the Waynes take over the, the spoof world, but it was great to see, like, new characters and new uh, creative ideas behind the spoofs. When you look at movies today or in the past, like, what other movies do you have you seen that, like, kind of inspired you? Like, yo, that's, somebody should spoof that shit. That somebody should spoof? Yeah, almost all these movies come out need a spoof to <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I think this is, I mean, in my defense, I haven't seen the entire movie yet, but what other movie to, to spoof than The Purge? Yeah. This is so ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah, The right? Purge is uh, definitely a movie. I mean, with all the crazy stuff going on in the world, I mean, this is like... People need to laugh. Like a, yeah, it's like a right-on-time movie, yeah, you know? Yeah. So if you if you could purge somebody, if somebody was on your list to purge, who would be the first house you you kicking out the door to, to purge if... Uh, if you had, if you had free will too. to do it, you gotta be honest. I think the tax man. I would love to purge his ass. <laughs> <laughs> you know them FICA and uh, federal and uh, who else takes money out of your check? <laughs> I, I can't say who I would spoof because I would go down a political <laughs> situation. Donald but I, Trump. Yeah, I would, I would spoof somebody in that vicinity. You'll purge Donald Trump. <laughs> I'm go ahead and say it. Too. Snatch his wig off his head. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe I'll just snatch his hit the wig off his head. <laughs> Welcome, Black Hey, 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 bro. Why are you yelling? Oh, you must excuse him. He gets so excited when we get to meet new people. Oh, especially different people. So, welcome to our beautiful neighborhood. I am Jim Smith. And that this... makes me Mary Smith. And we are... The, the Smiths. Smiths. <laughs> we come bearing gifts. Oh, you eat this? Uh, yeah, it's it's little goodies from Williams and Sonoma. So it's food. Never yeah. mind, he's not. He's a little. Yeah, he's a little special needs. Oh, I get it. She's got a brother that's got special needs yeah. too. Yeah. It's okay, little fella. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, like I've, I've seen like a lot of your stand-ups, and even in this movie, you got a lot of uh, bad breath jokes. So I'm, I'm figuring it must be a oh, pet peeve of yours, people with bad breath. Is, is, I mean, I remember you said it's about a Tic Tac with a battery in it. Yeah, you, you got like so <laughs> many bad breaths. I mean, like, is, is, has that been like a pet peeve for you growing up? Then? Uh, you know, I think that that's like, uh, I think that's just a funny, that's a funny go-to, you know, because. We're human. Yeah. But I did go to the dentist yesterday. I got a full cleanup. Mouth work, I'm good. So, so yeah. Zelaya's breath is, is all right, right? She, yeah, 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 yeah. I ain't smelled it yet. It'd be Not shame for it be that beautiful. Maybe about another eye from now. Kicking in. No, oh, it cool. happens. I'm yeah. telling you, we're human. <laughs>
Batman versus Superman is about to release, and if it was if we was playing the dozens, and it was Mike Epps versus any comedian, dead or alive, like who would be the most formidable opponent to be Mike Epps versus? Mm-hmm. Mm. Any comedian. Anybody. Anybody. It's Mike Epps versus everybody. Take them all. <laughs> Mike, yeah, yeah, everybody. Everybody. Any of them. I know, I know you're Colombian, but it's, it's very close to Cuba. I know the president's down in Cuba. There's been a lot of conversation about uh, Cuba and what's going on with uh, new relations. Do you have an opinion on that, just being from a, a neighboring country to it? Do I have an opinion on... Uh, on uh, well, I, I'm really happy where, where they are politically right now, the fact that they're a, a freer country and that we can actually travel there and that they can grow in their economy and be in a better place. Um, that's my only opinion. Uh, about that, I'm, I, I try not to get too politically involved because I'm just, um, I guess the right word is not that educated on the, the, the situation in Cuba, but the fact that they're freer and that they can, like I said, grow their economy and be in a better place, I'm all for that. <laughs> They got him. That mean they got my damn money. Cronut's going to little man heaven. Oh, daddy, now's not the time. They took his do rag off. You know he balled it. Oh, oh, Feels like we in a damn horror movie. Yeah. Okay, now what's the rules? What are the rules? The, what rules? The scary movie rules. Yeah, horror movie rules. Oh. We got to do the white people don't do. Survive. And, and lastly, this this movie has a great cast of. Uh, young faces from Brescia to King Bog to Lil Duvall. You think these comedians are making up the next wave of comedians we're going to see on the screen? Absolutely. Years to come? No doubt. I mean, you know, um, they have the beautiful Zule in the movie, and she's very, very up and coming. And I mean, you know, we've, we've seen some of the same faces in Hollywood for a long time. It's always good and fresh to see some new faces, funny guys like Duvall, Gary Owens. You know, we all love Charlie Murphy, Mike Tyson, so this is a this is a, a gumbo. This is a nice gumbo, a mixture Brisha. of everybody. Yeah. Brisha Webb, you know, we and everybody is bringing something different to it, you yeah. know, because everybody has a different style of comedy. Everybody has a different look, so I think people are I'll going say to, I'm not the one bringing the comedy. I mean, we, you can go ahead and say that. You're trying well, you to be know, nice. You but bring the I'm like the voice of reason. The yeah. I'm the voice of reason. <laughs> you got to have the fine in it. You gotta <laughs> well, thanks, man. I think everybody's going to enjoy Meet the Blacks and, uh, and everything you guys do. Everybody's always watching. So Thank you doing. so much. Nice right, to see you, you again.